done. Ah, I love impacts. All right, Milwaukee's 2962 half inch friction ring, mid torque, Gen 2. I mean, spoiler alert again, Milwaukee knocked it out of the park, but let's get into it. All right, guys, so Milwaukee, everybody knows if you follow my channel, I buy all my own tools. This is no exception. Milwaukee's 2962 <sighs> mid-torque Gen 2 impact wrench. Uh, this is uh, definitely an upgrade from the Gen 1, if you're familiar with the Gen 1 as well. This is about a little over five pounds with the battery, uh, six inches from uh, anvil to the back of it, and then I think it stands about uh, like eight a little over eight inches tall from top to now that's not with the battery that's yeah that's definitely not with the battery for sure a couple of things with this one it makes it a little different it's got more torque this is the half inch version so you got 650 nut busting foot pounds of torque 550 fastening torque that's on the that's on the number three you got four mode drive control uh mode one 1200 and up to 1250 let's get it right quick so you guys can see it real quick so you can see it down mode one 1250 RPMs up to mode two is 1950 RPMs. And then mode three and four are both 2575 RPMs. The difference between mode three and four is mode four is basically uh, start stop mode, if you want to say. Um, it will break away a bolt, but then it'll, as soon as it, it has electronics, it, as soon as it senses that it doesn't need the torque, it'll shut itself down. That way you're not slinging lug uh, nuts everywhere. You know, it's it just, it controls the the nut you're trying to take off, really, pretty much. So, or bolt, you know, whatever it is, um, which is nice. I do not use that. Full disclosure, I don't use that. I keep it on three. Um, actually, every all the time. I've never used this tool not on three. And you can see, I, take, I mean, most of the time, I just take off all my all my flat tires on my trailer, my truck, wife's car, all that stuff. This thing, this thing can take it off for sure. I did. Um, there was one one on the truck, but that was since it was you know brand new, and it was obviously, uh, you know, I got the uh, high impact to take it off, but it was on there for sure, and it probably it, it probably damaged the threads. Who knows? But um, I never took that tire off before. So somebody torqued it down real, real, real um, tight for sure. But this is absolutely um, the tool that I keep in my truck at all times because it'll take off pretty much everything from any vehicle, you know, providing it's not a semi. Um, I know 600, you know, 550 foot pounds technically, but those can obviously get past that as well. So a couple functions. It, it has obviously the four modes. Um, it's, it's a little more compact. The main thing upgraded from this one from the Gen 1 or from any of the other ones, you can see this is just a quarter inch extra. You can see that light. That's the same one as Gen 1. So this has the three LEDs up front, which is fantastic. Absolutely great. Um, that is great. I mean, Ingersoll Rand has had their little halo lights for probably half a decade now. So I'm glad to see Milwaukee kind of stepping it up with a little extra light right there. So keep that in mind. Um, 
yeah, man, this is this is a fantastic tool for anybody. If you need an impact, you don't want to go with the, the big Mama Jamba Gen 2, uh, 1,400 foot-pounds of torque one, and you want to see, you know, this is a little different right there. Uh, we'll, we'll get some size comparisons down, uh, but this is absolutely a tool for you for pretty much everything. Um, if you're in a mechanic shop, you're probably going to be reaching for this more than you're going to be reaching for the high torque just because it's going to do, you know, this, this is just heavier. Yes, it can take it off, the bolt off pretty much. Pretty much, but this one is just more convenient for 100%. And a couple other, you can see this is the uh, subcompact M18, and you can see the mid torque. See if we can focus a little bit, but yeah, you can see it'll hide itself just like that. So um, it's definitely larger than the subcompact, but um, this is only has 250 foot pounds of torque, 550 fastening, and then 650 um, nut busting. So. We get some size comparisons, you guys. This tool is fantastic. I would highly recommend it. And the only thing is, with you know, again, with Milwaukee's triggers, that's the weak link for it. So time will tell. Uh, most, you know, all my, all my quarter, these ones, these quarter inch hex, I use all the time. So these ones, the triggers usually go out. They will warranty them out. Milwaukee's great with their warranty. Um, but yeah, 2962 Milwaukee's mid torque Gen 2. If you're in the market, it is absolutely a fantastic tool. I would not hesitate to buy this again if I needed it and needed to. Um, links in the description for the other videos for this, as well as links in the description if you want to know how much this costs. I think right now it's like two nineteen or so at Home Depot at the time of recording. But don't quote me on this. If you're watching in the future, it could go down um, or it could go up, but pretty much down. So that's pretty much it, guys. Like and subscribe. I will see you on the next video.